Hi everybody. So today we're experimenting with pod voiceover pod captions, and you guys can tell me if you like this or you prefer solely captions. Right now, I'm on my way to find a gift for a friend. I think I'm gonna head into the emporium. I'm super indecisive when it comes to gift hunting, especially because I really want them to like it. I can literally spend hours looking for something unless I already have something in mind. I'm gonna go buy some macarons for my friends. I had a look around, but I wanted to be doing something useful. But yeah, and then I'm going to uni and meeting up with them. Anyways, my friend and I sat outside to eat our lunch and there was a little show going on. Afterwards, we went inside Arts and Cultural to do some work. After my workshop class, I went to Webs and somehow secured a spot in one of these little study nooks that I swear I'll always occupied. I guess today was a pretty lucky day. I was satisfied with the amount of work me and my friend got through. I mainly revised a bit of physio and I also caught up on a bit of pharmacology lectures. When I finally got home, I had a package waiting for me. Today we had the perfect weather. So I wore a little t-shirt and my jeans. Quite crowded, um, like in the shop, like at Melbourne Central. But yeah, my hair feels so dry. And like, I don't know, I feel like I need to buy like a hair mask or something. A package came in today and I'm gonna unbox it with you guys. Ta da! I got another Revectin face and body cream. And then I got these two creams. I got a serum and then this Dynasty cream. There are like these four little serum bottles in. Yeah, so cute. Wait. Under a vibe serum, this one is a glow serum. This one is a deep glow serum, and this one is a calming serum. So I'm gonna try one of these out tonight. Oh, it comes with a little like spoon or like spatula. Mm. I'm not sure if this is the right one because um, it said it was the new version, but this doesn't look like the new version. Yes, I don't think this is the new version. I need to check up on this. Anyways, back on track. I had this report due for Geo, but this one wasn't too bad. I'll show you guys what the trip was like towards the end of the vlog. The weekend came around and I had lunch with my family at the Glen. Normally I cover dessert for my family, so we went to go grab some bubble tea. <laughs> and then made our way over to this ice cream place which I've been meaning to visit for the longest time. Why? It has like Filipino and other Asian inspired flavors, 
We tried a few before deciding on three that we liked. I had an intense craving for pancakes this morning, so I quickly searched up a recipe online and I also needed to salvage whatever was left of the very ripe bananas we had at home. And yes, I really did eat six stacked pancakes for breakfast. That's okay, right? I was also preparing for an assessed practical class during this time. So I did some revision on the train before arriving around midday. If you guys have been watching, you know that I normally study in ERC, but recently I've been getting pretty sick of that place. So my current new favorite study environment is back at Webs. Today I plan to revise at least maybe one third of all my geo content so I knew I wanted to find a nice quiet but spacious place so I could write my notes and get some of my report done. I was also writing a practice essay here because our professor gave us the opportunity to write one up and she would give us extensive feedback as long as we handed it in with our report. So I didn't want to miss this opportunity to write up an essay about rocks. No, 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 I'm just kidding. I wish I was more passionate about the subject, but it was really nice to get some individual feedback and constructive criticism on a practice piece that wasn't really being assessed. Later, I met up with Mimi and she had some tickets for food. It was for some tacos and by some, I mean one singular taco. And then finally, when my friend left, I went outside to study the rest of geochemistry. Right now, I'm headed off to a geo lab. I'm preparing for like this practical exam. I have like some free time. I'm gonna head into the lab and work on it. Alrighty, and here's the field trip that I wrote my report on. It was super chill, no hardcore trekking, nor long days out in the rain, although it was quite drizzly and cold, but nothing compared to Buckin. 
I was surprised to see how lovely our accommodation was in Port Ferry, right next to the beach. We had Netflix and everything. And for dinner, we went out for Thai Chali infusion before rock pool hunting at night. The thing is, I always have poor sleep quality on field trips, so I'm usually the first one up. I made myself some breakfast before heading out onto the bus, and then we spent the rest of the day visiting all the different localities. This field trip was about the Newell Volcanics province in Western Victoria. We had a look at all sorts of volcanoes and lava tubes and some caves too. And basically we had to figure out the history of this entire geological setting. As a little treat, we went to a reserve where there were so many koalas and you could see them like right up close and they were truly the highlight of this trip. We couldn't stop gushing at how adorable these marsupials were. Anyways, this sums up my month of September. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.